Hi today we are going to watch a Chinese monsters action thriller movie. So take a popcorn and enjoy the movie. Some people are shown traveling in a boat and Gong is also shown with his daughter in the boat. Today was her birthday and Gong gifts her a walkie-talkie. During their conversation, the people see the dolphins in the sea. They were watching them being shocked and happy. But they didn't know the dolphins were running while escaping from a huge monster instead of playing. The huge monster has attacked the boat within a few seconds. They didn't see the monster, but the boat was leaning to one side. They fell into the water and Gong is shown again after all this. He comes to his senses and sees around and everyone was looking into trouble. He was worried because he couldn't see his daughter anywhere. Gong was searching for his daughter then he hears his daughter's voice from the walkie-talkie he gave to his daughter. They discover the walkie-talkie they are not the only survivor and there are many others on the other side. They reach near the survivors and give them signals to call them near. Gong has seen his daughter in the other crowd. He wants to run towards his daughter but a man forbids him. Because the man was seeing something terrible there. A huge thing was moving behind them and it reveals it was a huge snake moving. Seeing the giant monster, they were trying to run towards the other survivors. The monster doesn't give time to run because it was engulfing everyone in a single bite. It was flying people on the air through its tail's attack. Gong wants to save his daughter from the monster somehow. He moves forward to save his daughter without being scared of the monster. A man holds him because he wants to save Gong. Gong's daughter was seeing him but the monster has engulfed her as well. The snake has gone inside the forest after eating many people. The people get scared because they have lost their beloved ones. Gong is shown and he doesn't care about anything and was weeping loudly. Then he receives signals from walkie-talkie of her daughter and tries to run behind her. The signals of walkie-talkie mean the people were not dead inside the snake. A man along with Gong named Mao decides to save the people inside the snake. The others also get a grief for helping them. Later, a group of many people moved inside the forest to save them. The people standing outside the forest were calling them idiots. They feel it is equal to suicide to go inside. They were not saved even here because a strange monster has attacked here. It wasn't visible but its weird red tentacle was engulfing everyone. Everyone was running from there being scared. A huge snake is shown on the other side. It reaches its nest and throws everyone out there in the nest. It has moved from there after throwing them to collect more food. The people are shown have remained alive after all this. Gong's daughter was also in those survivors and the captain was searching for the exit. Unluckily, it was impossible for them to move out from here. The worst thing was there were huge eggs in the nest. The captain wants to check those eggs but Gong's daughter forbids him to do this. That egg can be hatched at any time. A snake can come out of it. Now everyone was hopeless because they feel they will be ended. A strange businessman breaks the egg while hitting a stone. Because he was feeling the snakes will die inside the eggs if we will break them. He has put everyone in danger along with him. A baby snake appears from the egg and they hide behind a cave while seeing the baby snake. The snake was behind to eat them. Before it could eat Popal it sees a lady there. She was paralyzed and was shouting for help. None will come for her help and the snake eats the lady while leaving everyone. The other survivors were saved here. The scene inside the forest is shown and the group who was coming to save survivors is shown running. They were following the prince of the snake it left. But they couldn't find the snake or its nest after many hours. They decide to take a rest in the forest for a while. Gong's friend Mao cuts a tree there. As he cuts the tree a black liquid appears from it. Later, an elderly man is seen lighting a cigarette. But mistakenly the match stick from his hand falls into the liquid. It was in that tree and there was fire as the stick falls in it. They realize the liquid is flammable. Gong was also feeling strange and was feeling severe headache. He was feeling dizzy and was feeling like his companions are laughing at him. He feels there is a snake behind him and hears his daughter's voice. She was saying, Father you couldn't save me, then the huge snake traps him. Gong was trying to escape and someone throws water at his face. It discovers here this isn't happening to Gong in real. This was the effect of the smell of the black liquid. Gong sees while awakening the tentacles of the tree are pulling people towards it. And trying to end the people. It means that this was no ordinary tree. Rather, it was a dangerous tree. They save everyone with their efforts except for a man whom the tree stabbed him. He died because of it. They get shocked while seeing the tree is moving its tentacles towards them. 
To end them. They run from there while scaring from the tree. The scene in the snake nest is shown the businessman has ended the baby snake. After ending it, the businessman was fighting with everyone. And blaming them that everything is happening because of them. Sushi, a girl, then calms him down and says we are in trouble here and we have to do teamwork if we have to move out. Nothing will happen if we will keep on fighting. Gong and his companion who will save them. We're still searching for them and Mao has made many weapons for Gong. They will help them out in fighting with the monster snake. Gong's companion is shown who goes near water to drink or collect the water. Suddenly, a flying creature attacks him and it was a monster fish. It has huge teeth and can fly out of the water as well. They are called fly fishes. The fish again attacks him but he catches it while escaping from it. He runs from there while throwing it again into the river. He discovers there isn't one fly fish there was noise according to it, there will be thousands of fly fishes. The boy runs inside the forest to tell his companions to tell them about the fishes. The fishes attack them and the people have to run from there to escape. They run at a speed but the fishes have a high speed than them and decide to fight with them. They end the fishes come in front of them with the weapons in their hands. They can't end all of them because they were in a large number so they were hiding behind trees. Mao was fighting with the fishes so his companions will escape from them. There was his loss as a result of it. A fly fish has bitten his hand. Gong feels the fishes were traveling with the fog. They move inside the forest where there wasn't any fog. They were saved from this animal's attack while doing this. The danger wasn't over yet because Mao finds a footprint of a huge monster. And they see the tree and find a strange monster. A man was about to end it with a stone but the other man stops him. During this, a strange tentacle eats the creature. We have seen this red tentacle in the movie before. Then a huge creature falls near them while falling from the sky. It reveals that was a monster frog and it has eaten people with the help of its tongue. They get scared seeing the creature so they run from there. The monster was behind them and holds an old man with its long tongue. The old man doesn't lose courage in front of the monster. He holds a tree to save himself the others also have come to save him and were pulling him towards them. This wasn't enough because the monster was so powerful. A man there thinks to cut the tongue of the monster. As he puts his knife on its tongue it doesn't affect it but the face of the man gets burned with its liquid. Mao, who has moved forward comes back with his weapon. He attacks the eye of the monster frog and it feels severe pain because of it. It has left the old man because of the pain because of it, everyone gets a chance to run from there. They were running from there but the monster frog also becomes furious. It was chasing them and jumps. Its small jump has covered the distance which they covered while running. Before it eats the people a huge snake eats it in the air. Everyone was seeing this being scared. A frog monster has been eaten by a snake monster. Snake's attention diverts to the men after eating the frog. The snake was chasing them as they were running. The old man and the boy on whom the liquid was fallen were running slowly. The snake was about to eat them when they arrived at a location in the forest where there were trees nearby. And when the snake moves its face inside it gets stuck between the trees. They get a chance to escape. A man diverts the attention of snake to save them. He throws a coconut on it but he puts himself in danger while doing this. As the snake was about to eat him he runs speedily inside the forest. He hides in the small plants. The snake couldn't see him and he was saved. Later, the monster turns and there was the old man with the boy. The old man run from there but the other man didn't discover the snake is chasing him. As he turns he gets scared seeing the snake and apologizes to the snake. He was requesting to leave him but unfortunately, the snake doesn't understand anything. And it eats him. The others jump into a river to escape from the snake. They hide in the water. Due to it, the snake leaves them and moves forward to its cave. As the people inside the cave feel a vibration on earth they start acting like dead. So the snake will consider them dead and will not do anything to them. The giant snake has thrown the man of gong as it sees its baby die it becomes furious. As it leaves they plan to move out of here, they were trying to move out. The other eggs of the snake were also broken and they left gong's daughter there. She has no other way except for sitting there. She contacts with the snake as she isn't food but a companion of them. And the baby snakes were considering her their mother. The snakes moved to the side where the other was while leaving gong's daughter. The businessman successfully comes out of the nest. But it reveals the businessman is selfish that's why he didn't think about his helpers. 
He has escaped from there. Meanwhile, the snake has ended a man there. On another side, Gong and his companions are shown they find a strange building in the forest. This was an old place but they found a shelter as this place. Reaching there, they discover this building as a lab and find the skeleton of a soldier. Its condition is telling that the person has died many years ago. After reading the books they realize the people come here for researching the creatures. Actually, the creatures changed into huge monsters because of their experiment. They try to contact the rescue team through the machines. Meanwhile, a man comes into the building and he was the businessman who escaped. Everyone was asking him about the other survivors. He lied to everyone that except for me everyone died there. Gong has lost his senses hearing him because his daughter was his last hope. They are shown sleeping and awake the next morning with the helicopter's voice. They move out and Gong was also moving there but he receives signals from the walkie-talkie. The walkie-talkie of his daughter and the helicopter couldn't see them and moved forward. Gong tells his group his daughter is still alive and many others around her are alive. We should save them. The businessman says you have gone mad none is alive there and they agreed. They were thinking maybe Gong is in a shock that's why he is saying this. As they hear a girl's voice from the walkie-talkie they believe many people are alive there. Hearing them, the businessman runs from there and the old man chases him to hold him. The others were searching for the snake's nest there was Gong's daughter and another girl. Her name was Sushi. The other baby snakes have come out from the eggs. The businessman sees the helicopter again and has attracted it towards him. But before he sits inside the huge snake eats the helicopter in the air. The old man has caught the businessman. The businessman has ended the old man and on the other side, the nest scene is shown. There were many snakes and moving forward to eat them but the snake came out first stops them. Because the snake was considering Gong's daughter their mother. Gong's daughter hears her father's voice. He has reached this snake's nest while searching for them. Gong has found his daughter. To help his daughter and the others he puts a root of the tree inside the nest. As he was pulling them upside the huge snake also arrives. Before it says something to them Mao arrives and makes it far from there while attacking its eye. During this, Gong gets the chance to take the girls out. Mao fought the snake until Gong completed this task. How hard can he fight? He was about to be devoured by the snake. But the other companion arrives and attacks the snake's eye. Getting a chance, Mao makes a tree fall down and the snake has moved far from them. The girls, on the other hand, have yet to emerge. The ship's captain helps them at the last moment. He tries to pull the girls upside and the girls have come out but the captain died there. He sacrifices his life for those girls. They were celebrating their victory but notices the snake also comes to its senses. They harmed it with that huge tree. The businessman is shown who has reached the place from where he started while running. He collides with the body of the man whom he ended and reaches the nest. From where he escaped with difficulty, the baby snakes have eaten him and the others are shown here. They were escaping from the snake. Mao says we can't run from that snake for more than a short time period. We have to end that snake. As he said this the snake also arrives. He asks them to move forward and starts fighting with the snake. As the snake turns he cuts its whole body with his stick while passing from the downside. This attack doesn't affect the snake and it was about to end Mao. The companion of Mao arrives to save him. They intentionally go inside the forest so the rest of the survivors would run from there. Likewise, they will divert the snake's attention. They take the snake to the tree in which there was the flammable liquid. The snake has also seen Mao's companion and the snake discovered their plan. Gong is shown asking his daughter to run from there and goes to help them. Mao has dipped his stick in that flammable liquid. Mao's companion comes back from the forest while running. Gong was about to move inside the forest and asked everyone to run from there. Gong realizes they have made a mistake and in reality, there was something wrong as they turn. The snake has again eaten Gong's daughter. Gong comes in anger and decides to fight with the snake. As he moves in front of the snake to fight with him the snake was about to eat him. As the snake opens its mouth Mao appears from the forest. There was a fire in his hand and the snake again runs inside the forest being scared. Mao was also chasing them as the snake reaches the tree in which there was flammable liquid Mao throws the fire of his hand. The snake was burnt completely. It moves out of the forest to save itself. It couldn't save its life and dies. Gong reaches the dead snake hurriedly to save his daughter. 
As he opens the snake's mouth Gong sees his daughter's hand. He pulls her hand towards him. His daughter wasn't responding. He feels maybe she is dead. He tries to make her awake while making her lay down. She comes to her senses after the hard work of a short time. Gong and his companions become happy seeing her alive. Finally, they escaped from the snake. And this movie ends with this scene. Thanks for watching if you liked the video gives a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe also share with your friends.